For the second time, a local designer hits it big. A Vancouver man, the latest to win the hit reality TV show, Project Runway. K2's Anita Kasey is here with this one. Anita, even if people aren't big on the fashion scene, this is a big deal, isn't it? Steve, it's almost like winning the lottery and getting a publicist to go along with it. Sarah, Seth Aaron Henderson gets $100,000 in all sorts of exposure. Not bad for a local father who got his first sewing machine just five years ago. How has it changed your life? Um, every way possible. Vancouver <laughs> Seth Aaron Henderson yeah, on a media grand on, tour. Uh, the husband, father of two, self-taught designer. Top. How many different looks do you have? The winner of the biggest fashion show on TV. Welcome to our big project runway finale. It's a secret he kept for two months. You, you can't tell us how you've done, but let me just right. ask you, you know, has it been life-changing? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's just kind of nice when somebody who's so kind and so gracious wins. From the day Anne Bonchi opened her boutique in Multnomah Village. Isn't it just beautiful? She's yeah. had Seth Aaron originals on her rack. I've, I've loved everything that he's, he's had here. It's, it's awesome to see him do this because this has been his dream. One Martine Hammond says never changed in the time since she bought his very first piece sewn in his basement. Vancouver, not not the fashion capital of the world, but he really, really was committed to it. And now, because of his win, I'm sending this dress out to New York today. People are discovering there's more to Northwest fashion than fleece and zip-off hiking pants. So we're known not only for our beer and our bikes, but, you know, for fashion, too, which I think is great. Bocce says even though Seth Aaron's launching a commercial line, he's promised to keep sewing for her shop. And this is her next piece, straight from the TV runway. And this particular piece, it... it it's going to go for probably around 600 so. His prices just went up, didn't they? They did. They did. I think they did. I hope not. <laughs> I was thinking about that today when I was watching. I'm like, oh, now I'm really going to have to save up for a new piece. Well, Seth Aaron's wife convinced him to try out multiple times. He plans to get a condo in L.A., but not abandon Vancouver. The family has considered this home for 10 years. Nita Kasey, K2 News.